Ram Ram. Welcome to another video of The Flowing Dutchman. If you haven't done so, please consider to subscribe. So, a company which is called Recover Fun sent me this package which I'm gonna unbox for you guys. And it's basically a uh, massage gun which is based on an old tradition called toxin um, that is present in India. So I'm gonna show you a clip of my visit to Haryana Rotak and which Veer will tell you what mas the massaging of the fascia is all about and he's gonna tell you something about your traditional arts of toxin. Now after that I'm gonna unbox this bad boy and after that I'm gonna wait for one more week to review it and to actually well I get a better picture of it because you can buy it at a discount and it isn't so expensive. Enjoy the video. Ram Ram. So I made it to Haryana. I'm in Rotak at this moment in a beautiful yoga and strength training um, shala which is called Yodgam and uh, I actually had a, a little motorcycle accident today and my left shoulder or my rotator cuff is uh, kind of stiff so um, Veer, there he is, is going to help me with some traditional um, releasing methods and this is a Terra gun but there's actually a traditional way of doing the same thing on which this gun is based. Veer, can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, this is toxin. Toxin? Yes. So, in, this is in the time of Buddha. So deep meditators, uh -huh. they used to sit a lot, so they used to have a lot of problems in their back. Mm -hmm. So, during that there was um, a, one of their therapists. Mm -hmm. So, he was the first one who developed the thigh massage system. Right. And from that, in that subsystem was your toxin system. Sure. And then as Buddha traveled, wherever he traveled, you know, all the systems of the meditators and those sanghas, mm -hmm. they traveled along with them. So today it's most, most prevalently done in some parts of South India and in Thailand. Hmm. So you see the modern application of the same two and how, paragons. You know how old this is? This is thousands of years old. Thousands of years. Yes. <laughs> at least, at least about 1500, 1700 years old. This is also what the trigger point therapy is it's, basically. You see, um, we in, in our Eastern medicine systems, mm. the, the fascial concept is very old. Yes. But in Western system, only two years ago, they have accepted right, right, that right. fascia is yes. the latest organ. Uh -huh. Till then, they refused that there is no such thing as trigger point, there is no such thing as the myofascial point. They were only seen as theory. And now it's a hype. Yeah, it's now very it's popular. The, now, yeah, now it's the latest type. <laughs> right, right. But then we, um, in our methods of yoga, through our methods of massage, mm -hmm. we've always emphasized the body as one unit. The right. same thing how you do with mace, the, the same mm -hmm. thing we do with modern powerlifting movements. It's right. integration. So the fascial network is one of the main contributors mm -hmm. of that integrated, you know, what you call synergistic effort right. between the muscles. So toxin, paragon, these help. Um, sensitize those parts of our body again and helps us recreate the natural synergies right, right. Yeah, for the body. Very so, cool. let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> so I'm beginning to sense that um, a lot of modern, you know, fitness hypes are have, have their origin in India. <laughs> this was not just India. No, back in the day, think of it as the whole Asian subcontinent. Right, right. And it was now and only after the Britishers came, the boundaries were clearly drawn. Six feet, no? Lift your waist up. Mm. So it was only when the Britishers came that the uh, boundaries were hyped up. But right. it was like think of it as Afghanistan, Pakistan, India, Nepal, mm -hmm. Bhutan, Europe, so like Myanmar, the, Bangladesh, Thailand. Right, right. You know, this whole belt. A very big was, part of the world. Yeah, because it was very habitable. Think of the habitable conditions here. It's right. not so rigorous unless you go towards the desert or unless you go towards the mountain. Right, right. So these were your prime settlement areas.
This is really good. Yeah. Because it's not very invasive. No, it's it's more than just a trigger point it's uh, pressure. It's yeah. more. It's also a rhythm vibration. Vibration. Right. 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 Like right. 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 Resetting. You know, like resetting something. Rubber right, tunes yeah. like this. Right. Ooh. It's gonna be interesting. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> So basically, people don't understand the word flexibility because there is no such thing as stretch. Muscle can't stretch. Mm. Your, this is point A, this is point B, and this is the size of your muscle. Mm. So unless you break the joint, <laughs> your muscle ain't going anywhere. Mm -hmm. Stretch means that you take point B and you move it away from point A. Mm. So when we talk about stretch, we're talking about the sensation of stretch. Right. When right. what we really want to say is range of motion of the mobility in the joints, range of motion. Now the biggest problem with range of motion is the space between skin, bone and muscle. Mm. Most people their skin is, we are very tight all the time, we are so mm. tense. Right. And because of that our skin starts to harden up. Mm. Um, it leads to your, you know, dehydration is also one of the causes for it. But it just tightens up. Mm -hmm. So what we need to do is, um, we need to create space between the skin, bone and the muscle. And the more space we create, the easier for it is for the joint to move around. So ever since my visit to Haryana, it has been on my mind like I really want a massage gun, but I just didn't buy it yet. So the fact that Recover Fun sent me that email, I was like, whoa, this is a great opportunity. So I'm gonna unbox it. Of course, I've got a big knife. Here you go. You can actually unbox that shit. Let's see where we'll get. Let's hope I won't damage the package. Don't think I will. Oh, that is a nice cover. Look at that. So, what have we got? We got a user manual. Very muscular guy. Could have been me. <laughs> Okay, so we have the, I think this is the aluminium head or the charger. Here's the actual gun. And whoa, that is a nice and solid build machine. That's great. You can actually put it on and, oh yeah. So it has five, five different levels to it. And it has quite a few hats to it too. Whoa, this is very, very interesting. This is a charging. So you just put it in a charging stand and it charges. So looks like a gun ready to shoot. If any burglar sees it, they won't come. So this is very interesting, an aluminium hat. So you just pop it in, there it is. And there we go. <laughs> I'm gonna have so much fun with this. So you have all kinds of different hats. There's a smaller one, which is very pointy. I wouldn't advise using that one, I think. <laughs> yeah, that is that is pretty, pretty gnarly. But in order for you to recover, it has to be pretty gnarly, right? So there are one, two, three, four, five different hats. And this one looks like a microphone. With every type of um, hat, you can get a different kind of uh, sense to the muscle. So uh, you can, of course, um, imagine that whenever you do your back, you'll need some more tension or you need some more power to it. Whenever you do your chest or your neck muscles, for example, you need a little bit more soft and a lower stamp. So these are all for different purposes. So one week has passed and I've used the Recover Fun massage gun quite a bit. And I must say, I'm very, very pleased with it. So I'm gonna share some benefits 
of this particular gun with you now. Now one of the big benefits of this gun and with any Theragun is that you don't have to use that much fire to, power to massage. So for example, uh, when my girlfriend massages my back, I don't feel anything. But if she uses this one, she can get very, very tight and very deep into my tissue. Now the battery life is also a big benefit of this gun. It, on, the, on the website it says about three hours, but I've experienced that it's more than that. And because you're not massaging three hours every time, you definitely don't have to charge it every day. Now with this charging dock, you just keep it in the electricity, you pop it in and it charges automatically. Very beneficial. Now another benefit is the many hats. I really like this one. It has, a, it has some air in between, so for example, people that aren't used to massaging, uh, it's a lot lighter than the other ones. It doesn't come as deep, but you do feel the same vibration as with the other hats. And I really like the aluminium hat. I've used that one the most. I'm not really sure why. It isn't that evasive. It's just very comfortable and you can get deep into the muscle as well. And of course there are more hats that have their own benefit. You can all, so for everyone basically there is a hat which they like and you also have different levels. So if somebody doesn't like massaging that much, you can start slow. If somebody really likes a deep tissue massage, that's also possible. Great benefit of this gun. It's very easy for me to use. Right. You know, sharper tools to go even more beneath the tissue. Oh. I wish I could do this on my own body like this. <laughs> <laughs> so at last, the price. Only $99. Now I've tried quite a few of these massage guns and they all at least were two times more expensive. And you know, this one feels either similar or better. So I'm very, very impressed. If you'd like to buy this gun, you can get it for five extra dollars off. So that's $94 if you click the link in the description. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you have any more questions about this gun or about massaging in general, please do consider to ask them in the comments and I'll see you in the next video. Danja